My name is uh, Jose Galvez and we're in my darkroom space uh, in Durham, North Carolina. Well, um, I got interested in journalism at a very early age. I started hanging around the newsroom in Tucson when I was about 10, 11 years old. Kind of really one of those uh, rags to riches kind of story. I actually stepped in the newsroom with a shine box and uh, became fascinated with the newspaper. I was selling the newspapers also on the street. Then I just kept hanging out at the newsroom. Eventually they hired me as a copy boy when I was turned 16, by which point I was taking photography in high school. And then went on to university, majored in journalism, and was given the choice and upon graduation of being either a photographer or a reporter. And I thought about it for about that long. I was very interested in, in moving to the southern region of the United States from Arizona. My, my photography up until then had been primarily Mexican, American, Chicano. And so we were really struck when we first came to this area, specifically Durham, by the Latino presence. It was primarily an immigrant experience. It was almost all recently arrived in the last 10, 20 years. So I was almost like immediately started photographing. The work that I'm doing, it's not an immigration project or body of work. It's about people. It's always about people. The people who are here, you know, they're, they're just like you and me. You know, they own homes, they're business people, they're workers. Their kids go to school, they have celebrations, you know, they play in the park. You know, I want to, I want, I want to sort of show a commonality with, with the work that I've been doing. There's a picture of this man named Jorge Ledesma, who was a Christmas tree farmer. So he came as a young man and worked on the Christmas trees and became an American citizen. But over the decades, he's wound up buying his own lots of, of Christmas trees. And so he's, he hires people, so he's a businessman. But he also works alongside the, the, the people that he hires. His dream one day was to have one of his Christmas trees in the White House. So wow, you know, here's this immigrant who, I don't know if he still has that same aspiration, maybe, I don't know but you know, that he would want to have one of his trees picked for the White House. 